<laughs> it's always been us against the world, ain't it, Tom? Yeah. Oh my goodness, that thing is so cute. I think that's the mat for the bottom, I want to say. Look how cute. The hell, you showing it to my dog? Yeah. Oh, she's showing it to them. <laughs> What do the instructions? It says all four yeah. sides need to be locked before you press, press down. to unlock. Would you press one? I didn't press anything. Mm, Confucius. You can't really tell what it is. It, it's something. It's <laughs> <laughs> pull your end, Jan. Well, Jan, don't pull it that hard. I'm sorry. <laughs> all right, stop. Okay, what are we doing? Let me, let me just do it right. Let me go yeah. one, two, three. Yeah, let's do the one. I thought you were doing one, two, three. <laughs> Clearly, you ain't doing one, two, three. Bottom. Oh, my God, it's so cute. Oh, no, that's to re to drop it down for the bassinet so it can be by the bedside. That's convenient. Yeah. Yeah. That's what I liked about it. Me too. That's cool. I don't care what you say, Tyler. I know something go in here because this would not be here. See that right there? That's a great one on that side, too. Are you talking about this stuff right here? Yeah. Uh, I see Jan. What? Oh. I was say get your right. Tyler phone and pull it up on the phone. What am I pulling up on the phone? I had to put the damn bed together. <laughs> no, you can use your... Let me record Let me get the iPad. Oh, seven. This is what G-Mama got to get used to. Go fast, man. Huh? This thing can't be this difficult. I was turning the video, I like, he had a little less room to pull it up. That's why I was like, it was so easy. All right. Okay. We couldn't pull it up because of this. Yeah. Way. Okay. So now you're going to push it down. Basically, yeah. Yeah. Can you have that side? Yeah. Oh, wow. <laughs> A difference. <laughs> Look at that. Dang. Look at that. Yeah, that's okay. why you the baby dad. High five. High five. Woo! -hoo! Way to go, Pam. Hit me, hit me. Okay, what's next? Because we can start. Right, that's the only thing, though. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. This try? says something about some pose. Yeah. A, that confused like, me. What are these for? When I look, it looked like you were talking about something that going there. Hold on one second. Okay. We got that. Oh, they got an email here. address on here and everything. So, do I email them and be like, you guys made it so damn hard to assemble this? Oh, Jan is that type of person who will write a review on somebody. Yeah, I will definitely write a review. Probably need Wait, pull up Asian dude again. He was showing me some good directions. Okay, get him back on the phone. Damn, we did all that. All right, I'm putting up the baby bed right Tell now. Damn, we can't talk. Because this was his job. He said, relax. Uh, it was difficult at first, but I got, we got it going now. <laughs> Alright. Alright. Well, this obviously has to go this way, so my thing is... Yeah, why y'all work on that? What? Look, the bed ain't got no pose. That might not work. It might not work, yeah? No, but it's supposed to go around here. Because this is where the, thing, the little mat goes. Okay. I'm semi right. Wow. You're right. You're right. You're right. Okay. <laughs> He's going, I think the size of it. See, that's what it's supposed to be for. Okay. Okay. We get now. That's when she was skinny. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> Gained like 50,000 pounds. It's all seven. When you have them, you're going to be a back of size zero. Ooh, I was never a size zero. It just sounded good. Thank so you. Tyler, <laughs> while Jan doing that, yes. I need your help. Yeah. You got to squeeze these. They go in right there. You got to squeeze them a little bit, and I can't. I can't. Now, seven better not be a 10 pound baby. His ass in trouble. <laughs> Who stopped the music? Tyler's all we did. music. You hear it, Tyler? Oh, what is that right there? 
I think it's like a backpack. Oh, backpack. that's funny. No. That like the that, where you can put like stuff I didn't in there. I mean backpack. I mean like something to hang on something. Like yeah. you can put the the wipes and stuff right there. That's convenient. But you know what? You can't put it right there. You gonna have to put it right in front of it. Uh uh. You gonna have to put it somewhere else because Jane gonna be sliding it down. Oh yeah, you're right. We somehow got this over here. He's doing that. <laughs> got stuff everywhere. I just wanted to come on here and give you guys a little update of the room situation. We actually moved the crib over here closer to the bed which should be convenient for me i want to turn the camera around so i can show you guys how everything is placed for now it is quite messy so bear with me but go ahead and take a look so we have the crib right over here we put his basket down below and his trash can right there my sweater right there um, but this is his little setup as of right now. I am washing clothes and washing bed sheets. This dresser, we're actually going to give it away, but I have so much stuff in here that I need to take out, and I just, uh, we didn't have time to do it last night. My Reese's things, these things are amazing, but this is his dresser right here. I would move this, but this is way too heavy, but, um, this is his dresser. We have a couple things on top of here that we need to set up like the camera the humidifier and then these things are just stuff for the kitchen like the bottle warmer the bottles and the drying rack and we only have two books for him right now so we gotta get that on the loop but my boyfriend wanted a tv in here just so he can play his game but this is our little setup as of right now it's a little you know what it's unique okay there's finding nemo right there we do have our shoes down below and in our closet i need to organize this today after i eat but we just got these new drawers in right here um this is going to be our stuff so all of these clothes right here need to go inside there we are going to hang up some of seven's clothes like his sleepers and his you know his big clothes that can't fit in his drawers and then we just need to get this all situated so we can put like diapers wipes and etc etc but this is what we have for right now we literally only put these in last night we were up for almost like two and a half hours just trying to get everything situated but everything that was in that other drawer that i showed you guys i'm gonna make it cute semi cute and put put it up here that way it's easy access for me this is just a bunch of random stuff that we need to situate as well but that's what we have so far um i'm gonna come back with a update and a better view after but this is how it looks right now and you guys will see how it looks as soon as it's finished Okay, so I actually just came back on here to give a little update. It's a little messy, so just cut me some slack. We fixed up this area in a sense. We just added this. I'm actually trying to scrapbook these items right here. So I just have it laid out for the meanwhile. But most of his books are back here. I need to fix this and figure out a place for my storage bags. But this is his drawer right here and i have all his clothes ready to go on top is all newborn up to zero to three months and the bottom is zero to three months as well and these are all three to six months and like six to nine months and stuff like that and then ooh, i have nothing but washcloths burp cloths and i only have his towels right there and then these are all um, diapers and baby wipes. And then these are his blankets and his Muslim swaddles kind of blankets. And then these are all of his hats, bibs, and then socks. And then I keep these pins right here to pin his socks together. I just haven't done these because I'm a little lazy. But yeah, oh, my legs hurt so bad. 
But that's his little corner right now. I have my little boppy right there. Sterilizer down there. I haven't used it yet because I've just been using the dishwasher, honestly. And then we come around here and this is his little area. You did see in the last video. This is his little cozy little nesting right here. Which we're obviously not going to have it in there. We're waiting for the mattress to go on top of this because this is not comfortable. But waiting for that. This is his baby bottle feeder. And just have it in there for right now. And then cute little pillow. Neck pillow. I don't really hang off on this for a minute. But we have his camera right there that we're going to set up. We're honestly going to mount it. We just don't know which side we're going to mount it on. And then this is our the humidifier right here. It's charging right now, but I've been using it and I honestly love it so much. So I just wanted to come on here and give a little update. We actually got this drawer organizer. It was, what is that? On top of the, the door? And the top we have diapers up here. We put some wipes. These are all of his washcloths and burp cloths. Well, not burp cloths, I'm sorry. It's just his washcloths. And then I had to put his extra passport wire in there. But some Aquaphor, um, diaper cream, his little... Oh, I heard such good things about this. This is the calming bedtime spray. So we're going to spray that on his bed and stuff like that. His little combs, his brushes... And then I have this bag right here that has like his medicines right here. This is just so cute. I got it in a Shea Moisture. I'm sorry, I'm out of breath. A Shea Moisture kit. And I just thought it was so cute because look, it's just like a safari theme. And basically everything that's in his little corner area is safari theme. Look at that. Safari theme. This is not Safari theme, obviously, but this is. So yeah, we just got that as of right now. We're trying to figure out more things that we can do in regards to that. Let me see if I can actually turn this on because I know this has been charging since what? Since yesterday. Hold on. One of my good friends got this for me. So it's a humidifier, obviously. It's too windy in here. But I love it because of these little lights right here. It changes. And then that turns it on. Oh, wait. I just turned it off. And then there goes a the light. So you can see the cute little lion. Oh, I love this thing so much. Look how cute that is. When it's dark, it's perfect. And they actually came with different shields. So... I believe the first one has, okay, yeah. The first one has the stars and the moon and a bunny. Best wishes for you. And then this one is kind of like the ocean theme, so it has dolphins. Jellyfishes, sharks, fishes. I think I said fishes. I don't know if I did, but oh my god. But yeah, we got the, um, we figured out how to work the camera. Now all we need to do is my boyfriend just needs to mount it on the wall, and that's pretty much it. I'm eating strawberries right now. Kind of slowly condensing this out to make it a lot more cuter. I'm looking at pamphlets of like breastfeeding and stuff like that right now. And I just need to figure out a place to put my storage bags and all that good stuff. Because I really just want to have cute decorations on top of here. And then his photo album. And then like other cute stuff. So I need to figure out where to put this at. And I obviously need to put these away as well. But... For the most part, everything is in his drawers. We actually, don't mind the closet, it's a little messy right now. But we put up most of his, not most of his clothes, some of his clothes. Because we just got more clothes recently. And these are all like 0 to 3, 3 to 6. And these are like big kids. So this is like 6 to 9 months and all that good stuff. So yeah, just have that as an update. This, maybe tonight or tomorrow, I'm going to start doing the... The witch hazel pads with the aloe vera so i'm gonna get started on that and then yeah that's pretty much it everything's all set up we're ready for him to come i have literally eight more days to go 
So I have these always maxi pads right here and then these pads right here. I'm going to go ahead and start off with these ones right here. I got these from a doctor's office and I want to utilize them. So I already washed my hands. Let's open them up. These are actually really small, but it's okay. I'm just going to open them up and then let's go ahead and get started with everything. So like I said, the witch hazel and the aloe. I'm pretty sure if you get the actual plant itself, it'll be a lot easier. I couldn't find the clear one, so I know this one works just as fine. As long as there's no alcohol in it, you're completely fine. You're going to want a spoon and a Ziploc so you can put them in. I wish I had the bigger Ziplocs, but these shall, shall suffice. Suffice? Sophie? Hopefully the camera quality doesn't change or anything, but I just really wanted to show me doing it. So I'm going to go ahead and put this on top. Ooh! I'm gonna go ahead and put this on top and get started. And then you get the witch hazel first. And then kind of drench that bad boy on there. And then once you do that, get the aloe. Any day now, I'm ready for you. Bruh, okay. I don't really know how much, I think that's good. Get the spoon and then go ahead and rub this bad boy in. Honestly, you can use your regular spoons, your metal spoons, but I'm just using a plastic spoon so afterwards I can just throw it away. But spreading this all over. I wonder how this is gonna be. <laughs> All right, close it back up. And then put it right back in the container as is. And then go ahead and put it in the Ziploc that you have. Get started in the next one. So I know these ones, I feel like these ones are a little bit bigger. Damn girl, I'm trying to ruin the packaging, okay. Okay, they're not bigger. They're the same exact size, but that's what you're gonna do Is just witch hazel Ah, I got it on me Witch hazel aloe Witch hazel aloe Okay, I just wanted to show it up close. I don't know if I could okay Come on Janet, you got it. So I already put the aloe on here and then the witch hazel before obviously and you just want to smear it down after. Oh, no! Free Shabaka do. Okay, we got it. It didn't do anything. It didn't touch nothing. Um, but yeah, that's all you want to do. Smear it up. Do the best you can. Wrap it up. And then put it in a plastic bag after. Hefty bag. Whatever you can.